what the 360 Challenge Stradale is, is another example of why we seem to keep coming back to these older cars of about 15 years ago, rather than pandering for the latest and greatest. And before we get started, the main reason is this. <laughs> road car that sounds like that. Now, the owner of this car actually has all of the special V8 Ferraris. So the 360 Challenge Stradale, 430 16M, 458 Speciale and the 488 Pista. And if you ask him which one his favourite is, he doesn't even have to think about it, it's this. And that just has to be why, it's just the noise. <laughs> under a little bridge there. It's the noise and it's the way you don't have to be going 100 miles an hour for it to be so much fun. It's nowhere near as fast as the more recent ones. 400 horsepower from a 3.6 litre V8 and all the power is near the top end. But you know what, it's enough. You can actually use all the throttle, you can rev it out and hear the noise, that's what you want from this car, isn't it? And since it doesn't weigh much, it is still quite a quick car. But the power's not intimidating, like the Pista on a slightly damp day like today. It would be sketchy. The steering, it's not hyper alert like the new Ferraris, but I think it feels a bit more natural. It wriggles around in your hands, it has a nice weight to it. Because the suspension is so firm, it does sort of dart about on these bumpy roads. It, it follows the cambers, gets thrown around, but again, it makes you feel alive when you're driving it. Now, a lot of the carbon ceramic brakes of this time, like in the Lamborghini Superleggera, they're all or nothing, but actually, once you even have the slightest bit of heat in these, they have quite good feel. So I've got plenty of confidence in them on a country road. Now, one interesting thing the owner of this car has done is rather than keep it on the old semi-slicks, he's put it on some Michelin Pilot Sport 4S, which I'm kind of thankful for today because, as you can see, it's pretty miserable. Now, I've driven this car before and I think it would have been a little bit lively in conditions like these, but actually, with these tyres, it just makes it more usable more of the time. So, second gear, tell you what, let's try first gear. First gear, full throttle. You can just use all the power, even in the damp. Now, you'll have seen a lot of this car on our YouTube channel anyway, because it did the Heveningham Hall Concourse. Again, making loads of noise up Horsepower Hill. <laughs> and it was on our recent Alps tour, drowning out everything else on the videos. And the owner of the car has said the same thing, that since fitting the PS4S, it doesn't matter if you get caught in a rain shower, but at the same time, it still gives you most of the grip of a semi-slick tire in the dry. I think that's what you want. You want to be able to use cars like this. It's, it's not made for sitting in a garage. It's amazing to just see it and hear it tearing through the Alps. Gearbox, now that's probably the biggest talking point about this car, the gearbox, the old single clutch F1 box. And uh, it's the main area really where it shows its age. But actually, I don't mind it. Again, the Lamborghinis of the time, there's a massive pause in torque, which sort of lurches you forward. First to second, does it a little bit. But after that, when you're driving quick, I think it's pretty good. You can see it responds to the paddle quickly. It isn't like the 430 Scuderia though, I love that gearbox, the way that flat upshifts are just bang, bang, bang. But this does have character. God, it just feels alive, this car. with you over a twisty road something like a new a45 would probably show it a clean pair of heels but you 
we'd be having nowhere near as much fun. And that's the point we keep making, that's why we keep coming back to these older cars. They just give you a, a sensation that newer cars don't. I'm just settling it down after that road, I've got goosebumps. Does that tell you everything you need to know about the Challenge Stradale and why it's so special?